Fourth Class Lesson 3 Reading A Trip of Memories From Address Vijayawada Date 310-2020 2. Dear Harsha Here I share a few moments of my trip to Horsley Hills. I felt happy when my father said to me, Hemanth, we are going to Horsley Hills tomorrow. It is also called the Udi of Andhra Pradesh. Then immediately, I rushed to my mother and sister to share this happy news. They felt happy. We started our preparations to Horsley Hills. I packed the things like shoes, socks, sweater, hat, etc. in my travel bag. Early in the morning, my father woke me up at 4 a.m. and I quickly had my bath. I got ready with my pretty travel bag. My mother and sister were also ready. We went to Vijayawada Railway Station by auto and reached it by 5.30 a.m. We all got into the train and were comfortably seated. We reached Pakala Railway Station at 12 p.m. We hired a car to Horsley Hills from Pakala. The scenic drive through the Gat Road onto the Horsley Hills was exciting. It has many curves. There are big and tall trees and dense bushes on either side of the road. The cool breeze of the hills touched our cheeks soft. The sampangi flowers on the hills spread their sweet smell. We all enjoyed that joyful ride onto the hills. A fresh and cool breeze welcomed us into the Andhra Udi. When we got down from the car, a mesmerizing scenery welcomed us. The whole area was covered with green trees and colorful flowers. The climate was very cool and calm. Clouds were passing on us. We all had a thrilling experience. We were at 1265 meters height above the sea level. Soon after completion of our lunch we visited a big rocky slope called Gali Banda. There were strong winds all the day. From there, we moved to the eastern and western viewpoints which are famous for glorious sunrises and sunsets. We watched a variety of birds and animals in the mini zoo where we had a lot of fun. The crocodiles in the zoo were a special attraction. We also heard interesting news about wild animals like bears, wild dogs, sambars, leopards, panthers, and tigers, which appear occasionally. Then my father took us to the nearest historical town named Madanapal, where Rabbi Indranath Tagore translated John Agana Mana, our national anthem, from Bengali to English. And at this very place, Mrs. Margaret Cousins, a British woman, composed a tune for our national anthem. John Agana Mana was first sung at a courtyard in Madanapal. Next morning, we came back home with a lot of memories. Dear friend, this is my wonderful trip to Horsley Hills with my parents and my loving sister. The trip gave me everlasting memories. Hope, you too may plan to have a wonderful trip with your parents during summer vacation to a beautiful place. Yours lovingly, Hemanth.